Hi, I'm Angie Metters, and I would like to share with you today on my mental preparation before I go and into a competition run. Or, um, I believe that it it all starts at home. I mean, I am a person that likes to see ahead, and I like to picture, you know, going there to that place or to that event, and. Um, most of the time I kind of have an idea of what the arena is going to be like or whatever, but before I run, um, you know, I think that I like to be prepared before I leave home. I like to have my horses, um, you know, fine-tuned, and what I mean by that is I want them responding to me, respecting me. I want them to not have any confusion on what I am going to ask of them when I get to a competition. Um, you know, I, I try to make it as easy as I can on my horses, and I think that is a lot, you know, it's just like you when you go to the dentist and you don't know what they're going to do. You're nervous and you're, you're scared, and, you know, with my horses, I want them to know what I'm going to do. I want them to be assured that this isn't going to be scary. Um, there may be a few little bumps in the road. I mean, there, there's always going to be if you're taking a young horse or even an older horse to a place, but um, I just try to make it where my horses are feel secure um, with me and they know what is going to happen. Um, what I also do is, like, I will go up to the arena, I will look at the ground, um, I will see what the pattern, how it's set, I will see where the timers are, um, I will see how long of an alleyway, like, how long of a, you know, if I've got a, a long ways to get a good start, or if I've got a short alleyway where I'm going to have to figure out a way to get my horse going, um, you know, before we hit the eye. Um, the ground uh, makes a lot of difference in how I ride. Um, if I see that the ground is a little hard and it's a little slick, then I will adjust my riding to that. I will make sure that I'm there for my horse. I won't go, you know, kicking him through the gate and have the reins just out there and for him to do it all on his own. I will be setting him up and trying to prepare him for the best way he can get around the barrel without falling down. Um, you know, and if the ground is deep, then it's a, you know, I might let him roll a little harder. Um, it all just depends on that horse. Um, I will go and see how, you know, far the eye is set from the alleyway to see how far I need to be riding my horse, you know. Um, if there's a lot of stopping room, if it's a center gate, whatever. I mean, there's lots of things that I think if you go in and you prepare yourself and you've got this mentally in your mind before you run, then it just seems like it makes a lot of things easier and you know what your game plan is for that run.